We're watching the final automatic transfer race into the 500 between Dale Jarrett in the 88 and Casey Kane in the 9. And as long as those guys are racing side by side and even three abreast, that's going to help those guys in front trying to stay in front of them. John Andretti getting in the middle of it in the 1. And they got the 1 car in the middle of the mix, but here comes the lead. Junior in the 8 leading Tony Stewart in 20 the second spot. If Tony Stewart were to win this race, it would be unbelievable because they have complained all week about how slow their car has been. But here he is in contention for the win. Tony started this race in 19th position. Junior started second. Greg Diffle led the opening 22 laps until a set of caution flag pit stops. He lost the lead in the pit stop. It was Michael Waltrip off the pit road first, and then Junior took the lead from him at lap 37. we have now started lap 50. White flag is up. Dale Jr. seeking his second win in a Gatorade 125. He won his qualifying race a year ago. His other three performances on Thursdays here at Daytona finishes a fourth, second, and second. It's a pretty impressive record. But Tony did complain about his car not being able to close up. You see that gap of three or four car lengths between him and the eight? That's really what he's complaining about. It will not make up that gap. Will not close up on the back bumper of the car in front of him. Well, his father won 12 of these Thursday qualifying races at Daytona. Today, Dale Earnhardt Jr. takes his second. Earnhardt Jr. wins race one. Close race for third at the line with McMurray edging Michael Waltrip, it looks like. And Hope lost two spots on the last lap. They put him out. He finished 16th. He was running, actually, he run 13th. John Andretti there in the one, just finishing outside the cut. No, he I didn't. No, he did, because Greg Biffle passed Cope also. So Andretti got the last transfer. And the 50 car there, left of screen, has got to sit back and nervously watch the results of race two to see if he'll be in.